When you first get inside of a Tesla, one of the first things that you will notice is the absence of all of the knobs and buttons. But most impressive is the massive screen. Yes, this screen can do so much, but in today's video, I'm going to go over 11 useful features that your screen can offer, and I'm starting right now. Now, with the climate control features, this is great for the cabin ventilation and also heating and cooling. So I'm just going to come down to the bottom here, scroll up. And one thing that you will notice that this is your air vent inside of your Tesla. And if you want the air flow to go down, we just pull down. You can do two fingers if you want. If you want it to go up, right to you. And the cool thing is, I'm not sure how it's working, but the airflow will hit exactly where it's saying it's going to hit. And if you come over here, you can also work with the back heat warmers as well. And this is great because even your center seat in the back has a heat warmer. If you're getting out of the car and you want to just run in real quick, you can have a keep mode here. And the keep mode, it will keep the climate control enabled. So this is great if you're running inside of the store. If you have a dog or a pet and you just want to run in real quick, and also you have camp mode, so you have different modes. And with the climate control, you can also schedule for your climate control to precondition the car. And this is great, so if you're going out early in the morning or like late at night, whenever you're getting off work or just have to go somewhere, you can schedule this on a reoccurring schedule. And that way you don't have to remember on those cold winter days or those hot summer days to cool off or heat up the car. And right from your screen, you can access all of your Tesla settings by coming over here by clicking on the Tesla car. Now with this, you can adjust your mirrors. You have child lock, glove box, windshield wipers, your mirror recording with the sensory mode, steering wheel, the brightness of the screen. You can control so much right here through your drive modes, your charging information, autopilot settings. Everything can be found here. If you want to put on your child lock, the lights, the display, the navigation settings, everything and I mean, everything about this car can be accessed right through the screen, especially when you're talking about the different functions and settings of your driving and also with the car. Locating superchargers and places to charge your Tesla, it is so easy right from the screen. And what you wanna do right here is, we are gonna come over to our screen on the GPS screen. We're just gonna tap and you have a, like a charge icon right here. We're going to press that now all of the nearby chargers will come up right here and if you press one it will navigate you right to that charger and another great thing about the screen on your tesla is the phone integration you can seamlessly connect your phone to your tesla and this way you can take hands-free calls it will read text messages to you you can actually see the text message on your screen if you really need to and you can send a text message without even texting so you don't have to worry about texting and driving the calendar that you have on your phone it will also populate on your tesla which is a great feature because if you have an appointment in your calendar especially if you have an address there Whenever you get in your car around that appointment, it will automatically navigate you to your appointment. Here in your Tesla, you have access to the latest podcast, radio, and we're not just talking about local radio stations. Just say, I'm from North Carolina, living in Georgia. I can pull up a North Carolina station right here and just save it. You have news and talk radios. So if you want to catch up on the latest news, you have your podcast here and music. This is through Intune. So just say if you want to go through another station, you have so much media right here at your fingertips, right here in your Tesla. You do have the option to link your Apple Music and also Spotify and other third-party apps right to your car for that seamless experience. And Tesla Theater is another amazing tool that you can access right here on your screen. However, you cannot watch the videos or the theater whenever you're driving, but it's still there at your disposal. So when you're charging or if, if you have downtime at work and you just want to go out and go on Netflix, Hulu, Disney Plus, YouTube, Twitch, it's all there. And if you have any questions, you can find it on my channel or 
you also have Tesla tutorials there. The arcade feature is another great thing that you can do here on the Tesla screen and you can play videos right from your car. Different racing games, this is always a favorite. The girls love buggy racing and also you have access to various games that you might even find on Atari like Asteroids, I know that's a great Atari. You can play chess if you want, uh, solitary, the list can go on and on. You can browse the web right here on your Tesla screen. You can Google for things and this come in handy for if you need information about maps, entertainment, what's around, you can just pretty much type in whatever you need to, just like a regular computer or a phone. So if there's a restaurant in the area, if you wanna check out this cool video, it will take you right to YouTube. And the navigation system is a very noticeable feature on your screen, especially whenever you're driving, because Tesla provides a reliable GPS for travel with real-time traffic updates, and this is with, through the premium connectivity. Tesla's use Google Maps, but it's not the same thing like if you had the Google app on your phone, but they are licensed through Google in order to use their map. Because with Tesla Maps, you get the up-to-date traffic real-life visualization it will update your trip in order to save time the same way that Waze or any other app would work. If you're at home and you want to go to work or if you're out on the town and you want to get home, right on your screen, you don't even have to type in anything. Just say if I'm at a restaurant, I want to get home, here on the screen, all I will do is come down, take my finger, I can scroll down and it will take me home. If not only that, if even if I scroll over, Again, it will take me home. It takes out all of the typing, and this also will save you time as well, because now you just stroll with a finger and bam, it will send you on your way. Toy Box will bring your Tesla screen to life. With the Toy Box, you have literally like a little box with some stars and squares, and I'm gonna press here, and from here, you can customize the color of your car. So if you want this car here, I'm just gonna show you real quick. If I want to go to green or yellow, uh, pretty much you can just scroll here and it will change the color of your car. But this is more like a space gray. So let me, okay, something like that. So I'm just gonna put it back. Uh, but you have light shows that you can do. Um, like a mission uh, if you want to fart. You can compose music. You have romance mode, sketch pad, if you want to look like you're driving on Mars, rainbow road. So there are so many things that you can do in the toy box. And again, you can do that right from your screen in your car. And there are 11 useful features that you need to know, not just dealing with your screen, but your car in general. And I'm linking that in the video right there. Check it out because I'm pretty sure there's something on that list that you probably didn't know about. And I will see you in the next video.